you get this show, The Good Place, and you're playing a robot. It's not a robot. And it, well, not a robot. But you're you're, play, <laughs> you're playing like a weird Whatever version of a Siri, yeah. Alexa, come to life who learns each year, and so she becomes more emotional yeah. and more human. Right. You come from UCB and loving improv so much. What was the hardest thing about it in the beginning? You know, acting, um, acting for the camera and acting on a set is so different, obviously. It's so different than acting on a stage. And it really is, it's like, there are aspects of it that are the same, but it's more different than the same, if that makes sense. Yeah, yeah. So it was like getting used to things like saying something funny. Nobody can laugh because it's being, it, we're recording sound, <laughs> and then f assuming that you screwed it up for the rest of the day. Being like, well, I the joke, I ruined it. And, and knowing that like, well, the camera guy can't laugh because he's gonna be recorded. But it, it, there's just something like, after a decade of, of you, you say something funny, the audience laughs, you move on to the next thing. The rhythm and the, that whole thing, that, that has taken a while to sort of adjust to. That like, right, you had a system for knowing yep. when things were working. Immediately, yeah. immediately. And Immediate when, feedback. Yes, and knowing when it doesn't work and knowing how to adjust. And this was more just like, you have to trust the director and your scene partner and yourself. And that's hard, you know? Um, you know, the very last episode that I saw, you played five different versions <laughs> of yourself. I, I think it's a 22 minute episode and you have 40 minutes of screen time. <laughs> yeah. And you're all, like it's, in, it's like, it's almost like somebody, the TV gods, is making up like, like all those time. lost years where you didn't get to do anything. <laughs> that is what and, that episode is. For, yes, that's so funny. It was just somebody saying, Let's give it to yeah. her. This is what she's always wanted. I Let's just. Her 20s when she didn't get a goddamn thing. Yes. <laughs> We're going to let her play every role right. of every other character. <laughs> We're going to introduce a new her. Right, right, right. Yeah, that was fun. That was like. I uh, mean, we're going to let her like kick some ass. Oh, yeah. And, and. I mean, I owe those writers my life. They have Mike Schur in the writing room. Like the things they have let me do, I don't even know how to thank them. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's really a gift beyond, I, I, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know how I'll ever, I, I don't know, I don't know. I, I said something to Mike the other day that I was like, I will be saying thank you to you for the rest of our lives. The, I mean, this is like, this is all I've wanted forever is this exact thing. Literally this, I, I couldn't have dreamed it better. Hey folks, thanks for watching. If you like what you just saw, then why not subscribe? Click right here for lots more off camera. And if you wanna see the hour long version of these conversations, I'm gonna give you the secret link. Here it is, offcamera.com. Check it out.